oh, this is not what I thought it was. Uh, it's just different. <laughs> no, Tom, nobody does. Nobody. You know what? The trouble is with a lot of the violent community, and I could tell with you and I could tell with Rob, that you lose people, you know. I mean, you like your music, but you, you go around. But but there's some people out there; they're fanatics. And I've been a fanatic, so I know. I know. Oh, you know, I was. Oh, I'm going to get that 12 inch. I'm going to get. And when you start buying a 12 inch of a shit song like Borrowed Time, you you know, it's just got it's got too much, hasn't it? It's got too much. And I remember about that time my dad said to me, like I said, not a Beatle fan, not really a fan of music really, but he, when I got the Milk and Honey album, and he said, he said to me, and rightly so, he said, he said, what, John Lennon's put another album out? He started laughing because this was four years after he had died. And I said, yeah, yeah, he's still got some music out there. And he goes, he says, you wait, next it'll be, John Lennon farting they'll release. <laughs> and you know what? He wasn't far wrong, was he? He was not far wrong. If you look at those Beatles songs that got released, my God. Uh, hey, Skip, where have you been all my life? I've got a song for you, Skip. Never see you looking so gorgeous as you did tonight. Never see you shine so bright. Mm mm mm. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you've got your song. Now let's get on with this. A lot of a VC. No, they don't. I mean, you, you try, and you're going to meet one of the most entertaining people of the VC, uh, Rob. <laughs> so I don't know what you told me that for. You're going to meet Mr. Personality, Russ Goodall. <laughs> you're going to break into Paul McCartney's house with him. Oh, King's Court, I haven't seen you for years. I love your name. It's really swanky. It always reminds me of Hampton Court, you know what I mean? Like, you know, uh, the old Wolsey and that, and his little pony and filled a cloth of gold and Mary Queen of Scots getting her head chopped off and the little dog coming from under her skirt covered in blood and dropping dead next to her and, you know, Henry VIII, six wives getting, oh, terrible business. Actually, no, it's depressing. Change your name. Change your name to the Queen's Vagina or something. <laughs> uh, Fizzy Pop has a ranch, of course. I cannot English today. I cannot English today. Gone a ball, Ghosty333. Thank you for the vampire crab. Awesome, awesome. JC Explorations. Jeffrey Mooney is here. Jen Ward. Last Fly Boy, Mandela Reality, Misty Rain, Rocco Donato, Ro uh, Rosa A, Salted Cedar, and of course, Teresa Lynch. And um, yeah, Ganker Proofs on the, uh, yeah, on the uh, Swiss Moco, the Swiss. I like the Swiss. DD74 is here, Faith, Hope, and Love. Uh, James K is here. Uh, let's see, Truth Sent You Free, Jessica Ma, there's Sandy Diva with her ranch, Preliminal. Uh, Dennis uh, Branham, Branham. I want to say Branham, Dennis Branham. Yeah, I'll say it like that. that's the first time I ever called you out, dude. Skip Thorn Hooter, <laughs> huh? Hey, Thorn Hooter, Thorn Hooter. All right, uh, let's see. Um, aka well, <laughs> B Tonette is here. We have uh, Susan Khaki, Mandela Mile. Mm, it takes a factory. Oh, is that it takes or fakes? It's fake. What is that? An F or a T? I can't. I can't. I cannot English today. It's fake. A it's factory. fake. A fa factory. It's fake. Okay. Yeah. There it is. Okay. It looked like a T. Deborah O'Connor. Put a B on it. Just put a B on it, Deborah. Just put a B. All right. You're so close to get my name right. Really, you are. All right. Lorraine Lamore is here, and. uh Let's see here. I did see. I saw Clarice was in here earlier. <laughs> Clarice. 